How's it, Sean, from Combat Simulations, keeping the island afloat from the Allies side? This is what the scenario we're going to be playing today. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions. And watch my videos. And also like them. It helps me a lot. All right, so it's a fictional scenario. All right, so initial orders delay will gravitate from 50 to 100% during the first hour. The final phase of Operation Garden has, has begun. You have done a smashing job to make this operation a success uh, so far. And we believe that one more big blow could, should see Jerry's whole house of cards topple down. The Polish Airborne Brigade has begun landing west of Dillon Airfield. The successful capture of Dillon will be an essential part of our next operation against Germany. So you must rush to get to that area and secure it as quickly as possible. In the meantime, we will continue feeding reinforcements, uh, you reinforcements, to exploit any breakthroughs that occur uh, and to help shore up your supply line from Nijmegen to Arnhem across the island. Use your bridging engineers to get some of your troops across the Neda region <laughs> west of Arnhem and outflank Jerry if you have to. Intelligence reports that strong German counterattacks should develop over the next day or so, aimed at cutting off. Uh, our bridget in Arnhem, so it is essential that you allocate your reserves on the island according, accordingly. Good luck. All right, scenario briefing. Um, the island, September the 23rd, 1944, 10 hundred hours, fictional scenario. When the bridge over Vil Wilhelma Canal at Son was captured intact, on the 17th of September, General Horrocks wasted no time in moving the bulk of the guards armoured to armoured through Eindhoven and into the breach formed by the 101st Airborne. The key bridges at Vechel and Nijmegen were both secured by nightfall on the 18th and by the following day the guards were driving north along the last few kilometres towards Arnhem. Heavy fighting ensured on the 20th. Uh, uh, on the 20th as the guards armoured fought across Arnhem Bridge and into the city itself. But by the 21st, most of the downtown Arnhem had been cleared of Germans as the battered remnants of the, I mean, that's the 9th SS Panzer Division fell back to the north and east. To the west, Tetu's ragtag division was still mostly intact as they dug in around Osterbeck. After shedding the first para Paris movements eastward into Arnhem. By the 22nd, the Allies had secured Arnhem and withdrew the first para to England. Many fight, many Mon Monty's lightning success was not gained without price, as the 82nd Airborne's rushed to seize Nijmegen Bridge. The German troops uh, corps felt advanced out of the Reichsfeld, overrunning the landing zones and clearing most of Gris Grispick Heights, and are now threatening the city of Nijmegen from the southeast. These attacks have effectively tied down the 82nd Airborne elements and elements of the 30th Corps in defensive positions along the city's southeastern perimeter. Even more alarming to Monty and Horrocks are the reports of elements of the Ostersturmfuhrer, Hamel's 10th Panzer Division, now forming up west of the uh, Panner, Panner, Pannerden Ferry around Doom. Doom Dumenberg. <laughs> Allied uh, intel reports also suggested that the elements of the that elements of the German 15th Army have begun arriving to the west uh, of the corridor. Yo, all right, there's a lot happening. Yeah, I tell you what, things are gonna happen. Okay, so now <clears throat> you'll see the map looks a little bit different now because I've changed the. Uh, I'm gonna try this out. I'll, I'll tell you why. This option over here, where you know where you get the all the scale, normally it looks like this. And I kind of, I don't mind this, but it does tend to get a bit cluttered. You understand? You, but the great news is you can see everything on the battlefield. So it does tend to be a bit cluttered. So if we put it on auto scale, which I never had before, do you see how empty the battlefield goes? Now the problem for me with this is that it's great. You can see, it's thicker, but you can't see anything else. When you go zoomed out, you can only spot the headquarters. And then even when you're zoomed in, uh, even when you zoom, you can spot nothing else. So you don't spot nothing. That means not even your troops 
or not even the, the 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 enemies. You can't even see enemy troops. You might see one there, but that's not the true picture. You understand? You've got to zoom. So it can make a bit. It can be. It 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 can catch you, because if you're looking out and you're watching the fight and you're thinking you were away and whatever, and you you can't see anything coming. There's no. It's only when you zoom in do you start to pick up pick up units. So that's why I never had it on before. But I'm going to try it now because I actually kind of liked it. I liked it. I was reading the guide last night. And this guy had it on. And it, it declutters the battlefield. And I like the fact when you zoom in, you can see clearly all the area. And when you zoom in, also the, the main elements like the mortars and stuff are these small units. But your main bigger elements, the bigger combat elements, like the twos and the fives, you can see big. And if you zoom in, you get everybody's the same size. So, yeah, I'm going to kind of try this out. All right, it'll be a try out video for this. I like the fact, and then when you zoom out, you just got that, you can see only your HQs. And when you zoom in, your HQs are bigger than the forces around, than, than all the other forces. And then the infantry and stuff looks, it's very, it, it's clear, it stands out. Do you understand? There's infantry, there's a little bit of armor, there's artillery, and you can sort of see the field. And then you get a bit of the armies that are there for him as well. But it just cuts out the clutter. But having said that, I still, I'm still, this is under, I'm going to use this under trial. <laughs> I might any time go back to the old other style. I know it's cluttered and whatever, but at least I can see everything on the battlefield. When I zoom out, I can see that there's stuff on the battlefield, that there's oaks over here. I don't just get the HQs of my units. But anyway, you're going to try because I like the cleanness of it. I don't know if you agree. So we'll give it a bash and see how that goes. <coughs> All right, now that's, that part's over. All right, so what, do we, what are our objectives? Um... No, let's have a look. We've got... Okay. We've got... Destroy the enemy, obviously. We've got Elst. Uh, occupation big. Completion little bit. We've got that one. We we own these objectives. Also, 10. Uh, occupation and complete... Occupation is big. We've got Eden. And these run till the end of the scenario. Six-day scenario. Well, up until six, uh, day six. Then we've got Eden also there. Arnhem West, which is that side over there, uh, 10, we don't have that. It's more completion, not so much occupation, like these ones over here. Arnhem North, which is also occupation and completion, uh, right to the end of the scenario, and Arnhem East. Then we've got Arnhem uh, Road Bridge, also mainly uh, completion. Then Dillon Airfield. Okay, now that deal in airfield is up here. And we're going to use the Parabats, the Polish Parabats to get that. That one is also, it's more occupation than completion. Then we got that area there, the Falberg, And we got Linden, which is mainly just occupation. We need to just sit on those X's. And they and they go to the, so you've got to remember this. This is from day one, which is now, but it goes to, that goes to day six. But that only goes to day three. That Falberg goes to day three. And this one... Or this one goes to day six, so it's weird. That one goes to day six. That one only lasts. That one lasts to day six, but this one only to day three. Okay, and then the rest of them are. I'm just checking you just to make sure. All right, so that that you got to keep an eye on. All right, so let's look at the order of battle. Uh, order of battle. Okay. Always on that side. All right. Let's have a look. We've got Oryx's 30 core. And uh, if I'm not mistaken, Oryx is at the bottom down there. He's in the he's in the battlefield. We, at the moment, we have the... We've got the guards armored. just want to just make sure I get all this. We've got the ar guards armored. Right. We've got the Irish at the moment and the Irish... Uh, the Irish... Irish guards group. And we have the Welsh, the Welsh's Guards Group, at the moment on the field. We're still looking to get the Infantry uh, Brigade, 69th Infantry, which comes later. And then the Grenadier Guards, 
it's still going to come as well. So we're getting a shitload of use. And the Coldstream Guards is also coming. I mean, here we go. We, 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 we bring in the, the firepower. So they're coming soon. But we have, at the moment, the Irish and the Welsh. And I'm going to tell you what I've done with them. Then the, the 43rd Infantry Division is here. We've got the uh, 129th Infantry uh, Brigade, which is over here. Uh, and we've got the 130th Brigade is still coming. Uh, yeah, I just want to just, just make sure. We have Princess Irene over here. And, oh, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Was it this one? Oh, okay. Yeah. And these are the, okay, yeah. And we also have the, okay, it's not, it's, it's confused me because it's not purple. And purple means I've given it orders. Okay, good. And we've got the the 204th Infantry Brigade, which covers sort of this this, this bunch over here, with the Somersets and the and the, uh, Somers, Somersets and the Worcesters and all of these guys. They cover the side of the field. All right, good. So what have I done? I've taken the Irish Brigade, and they're sitting. I put them. Well, the Irish Irish HQ is moving today, but his two brigades that are in the town. I've put them. Uh, on 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 guard in situation and the and i've moved i've moved one one or two of these o's further down just to help me out there but basically these guys are on defend in in situ in situation so i've given them the defend orders they won't move from their positions they'll defend where they stand all right and i've done that for most of them so i want the that's the irish guards and all these brigades have done the same thing. They're defending where they are in situ, in situation. All right. So they don't, and I've given them harsh defend orders. I mean, real serious defend orders. Like, well, it's just max, 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 but no attacks along the way until day six. So each, this whole brigade will defend in these situations with, with, with uh, those types of orders. Um, but mainly, this is the most important part. And on top there. Um, so the Irish are going to, they're sitting in this town. They're not doing anything. They're defending in situ, right? I've asked the Welsh to form up over there because they're going to do an assault on this objective over there. Let me just give you an idea. They're going to assault at max, max, and they're going to start the assault now. So while the Irish hold this, this, this objective over here, while the Irish are sitting holding that, they're not doing anything. The Welsh are coming up the pipe, and he's going to take his entire guards unit and assault this. Okay, so it's not a move order; it's a it's an attack. Okay, and I've given the AI their own time uh, when they when they must start up and their own sort of formation and how they're going to attack that hex. And they're going to form up over there. This is their forming up area. So he's going to collect all his forces over there and go and assault there. Uh, the Parabats that are up here because we need to get this this objective, which is the, the deal in the airfield. I've asked his group <coughs> to move in there, not assault in there, because I don't want them forming up here. Forming, I want the entire regiment is to move in there and attack this objective over there. Ah, here's one more thing. You know, I was bitching and moaning in these because I couldn't understand what is the requirements for holding this. You need a ten to one superiority in units. To be able to hold an objective so it's not the fact that he brings one guy in when you're sitting on an objective and you've got units there and he brings one guy in and then you think oh the object it's not that you need a you need a 10 to 1 numerical advantage or quality advantage in units to his to be able to hold the hex so it doesn't matter where you're situated around this area if you have got a 10 to 1 in units than he has you you claim the hex all right so now i know how that works uh anything else oh reinforcements okay good so now my plan is to do that is to the welsh to take this then in the reinforcements i'm, I'm talking about the big units now uh the 27 units they would be the infantry either them i'm just thinking all the grenadier guards whoever whoever comes i'll have a look at the units when they come but it'll probably be this infantry brigade. I'm going to ask this infantry brigade with the with the Irish Guard still defending over here, the infantry brigade to go in there 
and take this objective. And then once that objective is cleared, the Irish Guards are going to form up and grab this objective so that we have a full uh, uh, brigades brigades in these objectives. That's how I'm, that's my plan. And then the Grenadier Guards. So I don't know if I'll send the Infantry Brigade there or the Grenadier Guards. We are still, the Coldstream are coming as well. So we've got a shitload. And then maybe one of them can come up here. The other Parabats that come here, I'm going to attach them to the, uh, uh, they're going to fall under this guy. I'm going to send them in with the Polish to fight over here. That's my plan for the moment. Otherwise, over here, it's a delaying action. Whatever comes here, I'm going to hold as long as I can. Just delay him, right? Delay him in this area from getting through into these areas over here. It's all delay. And I've got the Princess Irene over here in, as a reserve. Right? I put one of his units is, is defending there. One of his units is defending there. But the rest of him is kind of like in situ on reserve here. And of course we've got I think this is let me just keep, let me just have a look here. Uh okay, that's part uh okay, that's part of part of the, the that's the was it's part of the uh, 214th infantry brigade. Okay, good. So they're also up there, they're just holding on to these also in situ. And then of course here, the guards armored division HQ is here and he's just going to sit there on situ and then i've got horrocks at the bottom now uh i've moved the irish even though these guys are in situ i've moved the irish hq to there out of the line of fire and i've moved his um um base supply base up to there that's it i think i've, I've covered everything i hope i've covered everything I'm, I'm sure if there's anything missing i will i will mention it as we go along i just want to get these guys down uh sorry i just want to get these guys down the road yeah and they put them back on reattach see i just got to keep an eye yeah uh, where he's coming Oh, it's mainly, yeah. Uh, okay, good. I want just, uh, just rearranging this so that it's in a better. And I want the Irish guards out of there. I'm just, I know I'm moving a bit because I'm just wanting to just check what's going on here. I want to keep an eye, yeah. Uh, I wanted to stop him coming down this road. Yeah. Okay, let him sit there and defend on situ. So I've got a nice sort of based, easy based defensive situation here. Yeah. And that's the most important thing. Okay, so we got some guys coming here. I'm going to move him, so used to these little icons, I'm going to move him up to there and I'm going to put him on max, max, so that he fights and attacks along the way and I actually want him to, and I want him to take the shortest distance. And I'm going to leave that other guy for so long. How's my, call? Is my Irish in there? Okay, good. No, he's still moving. I'm going to reattach him. <coughs> How's the Welsh? Okay. In fact, in fact I'm going to move him to... Onto this. Looks like he's coming down on this road, yeah. So we're going to give him some firepower. He needs to... Everybody needs to stop this road. And he's going to take the shortest distance so that he can get down here. How's it looking down here? Thank <laughs> you. 
Funny, these guys can't move. I don't, they don't have the move orders. I don't understand why. Okay, we've got an airstrike available. Uh, yo, what about down there? Boom. Uh, no, come down the road. the cold streams are forming uh welsh are gonna do this assault for me get into that place bro it's got a little force over here the irish are gonna form up here in this, this uh, nice sort of safe area and then assault over there in the meantime in the Welsh. Still getting used to this sort of like auto scale. They did fight over there. I wasn't looking over here. See we've got a problem here. Now these guys can't move. I don't understand it. And he's coming directly down here. So I don't know. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna ask them. I don't know why they can't move. I'm just like confused. Um, this is normal infantry. I don't know why. And I noticed this when I was setting this thing up. Um, that these you can't move these guys. Why can't you move them? I don't understand. In fact, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna reattach him, and I'm gonna ask him the HQ to move to there and I'm going to ask him to max max I'll give him power so we can really stop this thing and I'm going to ask him to face that way now he should move these guys let's be honest I mean that's the thing I hope he does let him let him let him do that Uh, how's the Polish doing? Okay, they're coming. He's making his attack down there. Alright, good. The Irish is still not moving. I don't understand it. It worries the shit out of me that he's not moving. I don't know why it's not moving. Uh. Okay, so what's happening over here? Is he still going down? So they're just tying up these guys down there, just delaying them. What's his orders delay on here? 30 minutes, so start time. But he's not moving these guys. I don't understand why. And the oh, okay, you can move them. All right. There's the one. He's moving him there. He's still not moving these guys. Okay, good. Or at least he's moving two of the guys. Maybe he's out of command or whatever. I need the I need the Welsh to start uh, to start uh, assaulting the six here. Yeah.
We have an airstrike. Okay, good. Uh, let's drop it over there. Okay, good. So the Irish are back. And what else is with him? Oh, he's got a protection, a self-protection guy. Okay, good. Okay, how's it going down here? What's happening here? Okay, bring it. Are you deciding to come yet? I mean, you're under the Zoke's command. Alright, they're coming, alright. So we're gonna hold there for a while. Attack and Dave, whatever. Just get there, and then. Oh, you can't move. I just don't understand why you can't move. I don't know. Maybe I. Okay, it's, this is still going good, yeah. Come on, Welsh, I need you on the road. Right, let him fight his way up here. Okay, Welsh, go. Go, Welsh, go. I need you. How's it looking up here? I didn't receive any... Alright, let that go. Come on, Welsh, go. We need you to go. Come, Welsh. Go, come. Go for the hex. Go for gold. Yeah, I can't move these guys. It's just, it's crazy, man. Oh, gosh. I don't know why I can't move them. I don't know why. I don't know why I can't move these guys. Why are they not moving? This is normal infantry, right? Or maybe I'm just a bit... How am I looking over here? Okay, they're going for that X. So, I'm going to move him to there, and then uh, Max, Max, and he's going to see if we can slow him down a bit there, and he should take the shortest path, I hope, <laughs> shortest, okay, good, just as a defensive there, so we can stop him.
Let these guys just tie up these guys over here. I don't know where he's going. Okay, so the Welsh are advancing on here. That's what I want. I'm going to move him up to there and to there. And I'm going to keep him normal. He's going to attack along the way. Uh, it's one of the, from the guards group, help out there. Okay, let him come down there, just plug that hole there. I got infantry here, uh, so this will stop him on this line, yeah. Have I received any reinforcements? No. Okay, good. We need to we need to get this objective. Uh, it looks like he's assaulted with successive lines, which is brilliant. I like the fact that he did all that. But he needs to drive past there. Uh, he needs to clo close this gap over here. I didn't come as a nice row of infantry here, so I'm keeping that. help out here because we're getting a bit stuffed up here and I need him to go in there and help okay so we got this objective yay Put him with some max aggression. Aggression, yeah. Uh, okay, go. like a floodgates, like keeping the floodgates going. So we're holding him here well. When do I get my reinforcements? Okay, I should be receiving them soon.
Okay, so the Polish, oh, the 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 uh, the base has arrived. Okay, good. So we're next. Okay, so we got them. So these guys, I'm going to reattach. Right, so they and he's gonna use these guys to help him with this objective. Yeah, he's gonna use these guys. He's gonna and we're gonna see if we can get that 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 airfield over there, Dylan Airfield. I'm gonna watch it down here. I see. This is always a dangerous area. Yeah. These guys are done pretty well, yeah. The old of that lot there. So keep the Irish here guarding this objective, allowing the Welsh to consolidate over there. Okay, we've got an airstrike. I want this airstrike. Right on there. How's my combat power full? So that's keeping that 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 available. Yo! Tense! I don't know about these guys. I don't know what their story is. I might as well just because they're not gonna. I'll reattach them. Maybe they can be called in. Who knows? I'm gonna move his. Uh, I'm gonna change his box. Make him auto. So maybe he can bring these guys that side. I need to stop this part here because obviously he wants to come through here, and uh, that's a that's got to be stopped. Okay, the Irish, the Welsh have secured that. How's the Polish doing? Is he following orders? Okay, so he's... Six o'clock. Now I want the Welsh to sit there and occupy this. When do our reinforcements come? Uh, day two, six, six, six tomorrow morning. We get the infantry, and they're going to help out the Irish guards here. They're going to help out, and I, I think I'm going to send them on that route. Depending on the situation over here. <coughs> um. I'm still getting used to this uh, this uh, overview that's like minimalistic. <laughs> Jury's still out on this.
them all just well scored. Some are clamping up here. Oh, they didn't mold that. So we should have held this a bit. Did well here for now. Don't know. I'm leaving these two O's up here as supplementary guards I must admit I like this these icons not military not military icons so you can never understand that rubbish I couldn't you can at least see that these this is mainly infantry that's mainly anti-tank I know I'm pointing out on this but you got this I've never liked this this uh, use military symbols you know this this I don't like this. I've never liked this. I don't know where this is artillery and this little square. That might be some tanks and whatever. I hate that. Never liked it. I know they use it. They use it for, but you can never see. You get all these various little, with the pictures, with the pictures, you can see this is mainly infantry. You can see that's like a anti-air. That's an anti-tank. Uh, you can see this is motorized infantry, mainly. It's not all. You can see there's an anti-tank there. Are you with me on that? It's just so much easier to read. I don't know why people don't, guys, uh, developers don't go with this type of stuff. Throw those uh, NATO symbols, symbols out the window, man. I never liked them. And the, uh, um, the Flashpoint campaigns, when I played that, I uh, also had this on this type of thing where I could see this is mainly tanks. This is mainly motorized infantry. You could see it. This could be recon. Uh, you can see anti tank, anti air there. You know, you don't have to look at the symbol and try and figure out the little square and the cross and the triangle and the cross in the between. Ah, uh, rubbish. Never liked military uh, symbols. I know they use it for detail, that it's, uh, you don't like it. I'm so glad that they show it like this. Really, uh, I know you can't get around it. Some games will come with that. I mean, I'm not like completely like I hate it and I'll, I'll not play it. But I, I just, I just prefer it like this so I can see what's going on. All right, brilliant. So we've secured this objective. We're still holding on to these objectives, these ones, these ones, those ones, and those ones, and we've kind of. We've kind of this O, this O, and now I don't know why this O is not moving and why you can't give a move to this guy. I don't know why, so I'm a little confused with that. Okay. Good. All right. So it's night time. I'm gonna pause the video until this, till this, till the reinforcements or there's any or more action. Okay. So the infantry brigade. This where is he now? It's 130th infantry brigade. The whole brigade. I've sent up this road here, and they're gonna take this objective over there. They're gonna secure that. And I've asked the Irish to just secure this objective over here because he's climbing in here and I, I'm not able to hold it. So I just want him to contract and hold this objective until the... And they're going to be the holding guys. They're going to be the holding guys. They're just going to hold this objective over there, this area here. And then the infantry brigade is going to go up there. Uh, yeah, I've asked him also that to do, bring all these guys from the field and go and help out over here. And these guys that were just lying at the back, yeah. He got an oak in, yeah. 
I don't know, like an artillery, oh, who knows. But that's fine. We're going to hold on to these objectives so long. I'm going to bring the... Uh, well, I'm going to wait. Because I don't know what's over here. These guys with advance, man. But they're not sleeping, are they? Okay, he's giving out orders. So start advancing and moving! The well up Welsh are holding out there. Looks like our paratroopers are making some ground over here. I know Oryx in the back there, he just has to he just has to he just has to fuzz bait. Okay, so somebody else has arrived. Uh, let me just place... I'm going to pause the game and make these guys reinforcements. Okay, so one of the battalions of the Grenadiers Guards arrived. I've just moved him up here. I'm going to wait for his entire lot to arrive. Just moved him up there for now. These other guys are coming down now. Should be able to take care of this. Help Oryx here. I'm going to ask him. That's one of our battalion headquarters. If I'm not mistaken, I'm going to ask him to do some more. And who's he? I'm going to reattach these guys to him. And reattach them. And I'm going to ask him to bring in his force and just see if he can block this hole over here. I just drive them off Oryx's group there. Let him just contract onto this X over here. So you can just keep this opening here. That he might go for that, but he's a bit... The Welsh, I'm just sitting here. They, there's nothing I can do with the Welsh. He's not... He's stopping the lot that's coming down there, I suppose. They'll just drive him off the road there. Yeah. Let him just bugger... Moor him off the road there. I'm going to bring this guy down to here. That's the Irish, the Princess Irene tax, and I'll keep it as shortest. Uh, you know, make it quickest. So they'll follow the road. Just to help out over here because there's a problem there. Shucks. Let's 
it's just shortest because I know he wants to Paratroopers are advancing down here. Okay, great. The Grenadiers have arrived. Okay, I'm going to plan their moves. Pause this video and plan this. Okay, so the coal stream I've reattached the one that was with him. I'm in the Grenadier, and I'm sending them up the the line. They're going to take this hex over there. Yeah, you're going to take that objective over there. We're going to uh, we're going to do it the shortest, so that you don't go all over the place. You fight your way up here, clear the line up here. So I think we cleared this little arc that was here on the back side, yeah. Where are you going? Okay, good. Let them come up, this, wipe this lot out here. I really is still going down there, so we need to get him down there. Once I've secured these two uh, objectives, then I'm going to send the Irish to help out with the Welsh over there, depending on how that works. Because our next reinforcements is on day four. Right, we're only sitting on day two now. Yeah, I'll bring him there. And I'm going to reattach him as well. Oh, this is, yeah, so he's reattached. Just so that we can get... How's the Polish doing here? Yeah, they're battling along the way. Yeah, it's coming, the Polish are battling. I'm keeping this guards, this Welsh guards here is, is, is blocking a, an important highway here. Let's see if we can... You know what, I don't want to... Now let's see if we can just assault him off this... Just a little bit. Let's just see if we can assault him off that, uh, drive him off this lot here yeah, with the with the Welsh. I actually want him to have an all-round defence, man, because he's got this this thing where he's pointed all the guys outside. doesn't look good. I'm going to actually reattach him and I'm going to move him in there and I'm going to Maxman uh, to give him all the stuff and we'll give him till tomorrow and I'm going to give him a facing to there. Yeah.
See if we can just drive him off that objective. What's my parabats doing? Oh, well, they're coming. Shortest. Yeah, come on, get up the road. It's just too much over here. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to reattach him and I'm going to give him a defend order here. Boom. Uh, in fact, I'll give him a move order. And let him... And give him an all-round defense. And he can do that. He can do that, yeah. Yeah, give him an all round defense. I did ask him for an all-round defense, didn't I? Sure I did. Why the hell is he not doing it? I said all-round defense. That means he must put some oaks over here. It's fine. I've got guys coming through there. He can do whatever he needs. Jesus, man. 
What is this guy? He's insidious. He comes from all over. Why is he down here? The, the objective's up there. Just effing with my stuff over here. I'm gonna pause it until some some action some scary action happens here. All right, so uh, <laughs> it's coming. I've uh, basically this is the situation. Yeah, we still we, we don't we've lost this objective, we've lost that one. I'm still delaying here yeah, with a delaying action. We're holding that one still, and we're holding that one keeping this one i brought the princess irene down here uh, all these bits and pieces i've left him there as a delaying action i might ch bring him bring him up later i've moved the irish this way just to open the bridgehead over here so that there's some space for everybody to get through and drive him away from there so that's what the irish have done these oaks are still going into their hexes and the grenadiers are still working into their into their objectives. As far as the parabats are concerned, uh, where's the guy now? Is it this guy? Yeah, I've. Uh, oh, I don't know if it's him. Yeah, I've actually. They still. They still fighting for this for this objective. <laughs> oh, there he is. There, I think he is. I think. Was it that one? Yeah, I've put him just past that objective. So he could just drive that lot off there. Took some heavy casualties, but I'm glad I've moved this Irish guard up to here to drive this lot away so we can get some supplies to the Welsh over here. And also, we've got this objective now, and we just need to drive into that one. The only problem is these little items here. I'm going to change his, uh... To make it more like that. So he's facing most, mostly with these guys. I brought these guys back up here. Yeah? I'm going to carry on up there. That HQ over there. These, these guys are still fighting to get in there. They're slowing him up here, over here. That's the important thing. He's getting slowed up over there. And these guys are kind of like brought back up the road. Yeah. Just to trip them. Because there's no need for them here anymore. And him up the road here yeah, to help out here. Yeah, because I've got, I brought the Irish guard over there. He's standing there and defending this. Because there, you see there's our main D division HQ. And he's just guarding over there. He had no no troops there. So what I... I kept him there. He's one... He's one I think this is a... Uh, these are... Yeah, they're armored cars and stuff. I've just kept him just to sit on that X there. And, uh... Oh, I forgot about why is he over there. Okay, I actually want him to move up there. Yeah. That's actually what I want him to do. I didn't realize he was... In the way, yeah. Taking, taking the fight. I want him on the backside. Yeah. This is what. Uh, let me just see who this is. I just didn't realize who this was. Um, shortest. Just give me a second. Yeah. Let's just check who this guy is. Okay, that's the infantry brigade's headquarters. Yeah. No, he needs to go back up there. I didn't realize that he was parking off here. Okay. Cool. In the in a fight in the way here. Orange is still yeah with this oh yeah on the side yeah well, whatever we're getting some uh, reinforcements day three tomorrow we must just get th these are the objectives we need to secure we've secured that one this one is still we're sitting with the Welsh guards over there I've set the Irish just to let's just change the angle a little bit so it's more 
Ja. So we can just keep this lot going over there. Just change his angle. Put his when you do that, it puts his best guys, puts all his armored guys in front, and there'll be nothing behind. Now you can drive for this 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 objective. Yeah, let's see if we can get it. Just worry about the Welsh. We'll sort the Welsh out later. Let's just get those two objectives now. And uh, once those two are, are, are once he's got this one. I don't know about the Parabats. They're giving it their best shot. Let's put it that way. There's nothing I can do to help you right now. As long as I secure this. I'm just going to wait and see if these guys... I might detach one of these battalions here from the Grenadiers. And help out over there. Maybe with a Welsh or whatever. Just to expand the bridgehead. Now the Welsh, I'm going to, I'm going to change their, dip, their position, sorry, their disposition. I know I had an all, that, I had an all round defense. I think I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to make it like that. And I just want to see, let's pause this. I just want to see if I can expand the, no, I don't want it so big. Yeah, that's the normal, and then it's down to 500, and then 500, yeah. I actually want, no, I don't want it at 2,000, maybe 1,000. What about 1,000? Let's see if we can expand the influence around there. I'm just going to... Just so they, they spread out, yeah. They've got that area to defend. The Irish are just going to open this hole over here, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking of driving them a little bit more, a little bit more down this road, yeah. No, you know what, leave him just there, leave him just there, just leave him there, don't drive him too much just yet, he's not... We just need to make sure this division clears that. You know what I'm going to do? I might... I might take this lot... And move him in there. And... Give him just to drive that out the way. Just to drive that out the way, and I'll make it shortest. This one battalion. Just to see if we can drive this lot away over here. There. From the grenadiers. I'll reattach him after there's a. Just to drive this lot away, yeah. Just to help help this the this brigade, infantry brigade, to get into that objective there, drive these guys away. Right, let's just see what's going on over here. No, he's still fighting. <laughs> he's, he's not going to get that objective.
just to cover the this infantry brigade's this, uh, left flank here. That's why I'm doing it. He must just go in there and clear that mess out over there. If he can. I'm sure he should be able to. Well, I hope so, because I need the one... Because that means you've just got... The Grenadiers have got, like everybody, they've got two battalions. You understand? They've got the, the Guards HQ, the second Grenadiers, and the first Grenadiers. The first Grenadiers will hold that. The, the, the second will go in there. Okay, he's got all his guys defending there. I need that defense. Let him go in there. Yeah, and he's holding that beautiful. Okay, good. Now we just expanded the bridge area. Just the Irish guards, yeah. The Welsh. I've expanded their reach, but they're just not... I don't know. Let's see if they'll expand that a bit. Gotta watch this bastard over here. Because I've lost this objective here. Yeah, he's insidious. He gets right behind your backside. I'm gonna have to move him back in there. Damn it. I'll take his facing off. Let him go back in there. He's gonna have to go back in there. I need that objective. Now nah, he's gone and use it because it's useless. He's got a... Nobody's come yet. That's the real problem. Let him keep fighting this guy, yeah. Come on, Irish, go in there. How's he doing? Oh, he's coming. Hey, so he's still going for this exit. Come on, Irish, move back. I expanded him too far. Damn, I moved the Irish too far back. Uh, HQ.
Alright, so it's time for you to help out over there. Take your entire, and do it the shortest, take your entire group and send them back to here to help out here. Okay, so we got this objective. Oh, can you believe it? Okay, come back, Irish. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Yeah, come back. You need to stay here. Uh... And you'll need to set up an all kind of defense. I think by expanding this, I actually drove. That's useful to know. By expanding this, I drove these O's away from that objective. And I think I'm going to do the same here. I think that's usually what it is. Yeah, okay, that's what it really Oh, no, that's what it is. Okay, yeah. Just checking out how this game works. Okay, we're going to keep it on auto. Yeah, that's better. Alright, so the Irish are back. I have to drive them back. Hey. Let's get you back to that objective. Let's get you back to that objective. Okay, and you can go back to there right and you can go back to there and you can take your guy with you right and fight your way along the way i actually want an all-round no i don't want an all-round defense but i don't want a I don't want to, because he brings a little mortar guy in there and then suddenly he's got like 10 times my, let him drive past there, okay, is he still, is he still driving in there, good, I'm glad, yo, what a fight, okay, I'm going to pause the video until there's any changes or the reinforcements come, okay, so the first reinforcements have arrived, part of the, Coldstream, one of the Coldstream battalions. Coldstream's coming. I would have waited for the Coldstream, but I'm thinking, geez, look at the reinforcements. Uh, 10 till 1600. So we could be here all day. So I'm going to let them go. Uh, they're going up this road and they're going to go and help out over there. The great ideas. We might change their move depending. Just to block this hole. I used them there. I might send the grenadiers all the way up here. Where are they going to go though? So bring his lot over here so you can help out over there. So I brought this one brigade back here from the uh, Grenadiers just to clear this, this road over here and I might reassign it. Parabats are in the X but they're not going to. I'm wondering if I must drive him but he's just got too many forces here. Let's see if we can just drive him a little bit off the X maybe or...
Where are you going yet? Are you going? Okay, you on your way. All right, brilliant. I'm glad. I'm just wondering where to put you. I'm going to reattach him so he can help out here. Yeah? And I'm going to put him there. Just off this. Just on this road, so we can drive him off this road, yeah. And those guys are still caught wanting to go into the X. Hopefully, did we receive anything? No. We're still holding to that. We still have that odd one. Odd one. We're still holding on to that. Thank goodness. And I've kept him just as he is over there. So he's helping out clear this road. So it's not such a... And I've asked... This guy over here, there's a Princess Irene, I think, just to go and help out over there. This is the Princess Irene, right? Just double check. Yeah, the Princess Irene Brigade, just to just to clear out this, this, this and sit on there. so that he can kill that move those O's out and this infantry brigade is still trying to get into this objective and it's a tough one a Welsh are holding there I'm keeping them quiet I brought, I've managed to build him back here just to cover our HQ, our Oryx. Now, you see what I'm saying? Because they could come anywhere between 10 and 4 o'clock. So I'm not going to wait for them. I'm just wanting to see if this will help. change his move maybe he'll go that way yeah interesting fight I tell you what <laughs> see so they can come up with these ones I tell you all right I'm gonna pause this video all right we got an airstrike oh, why not okay good I want to use it right on that HQ boom okay I'm gonna pause this until until the rest of the uh, cold stream comes and then I'll unpause it I'm gonna pause it now until then okay so the uh, yeah let me show you <laughs> the 69th infantry brigade has arrived the entire you well not everybody because there's one more unit there's the Howard Green still hasn't come right so this brigade, I'm sending all the way up the road. They're going to fight all their way. They're going to go the quickest way through there, through there, through there, and into here to help the Parabats at this place. And their, sec their other brigade, this one that's coming now, I'm going to use him as a fire. My, I'm not going to send him up there. That's enough for the infantry brigade. I'll probably just send him to help out down here. Like I've done with these guys over here. Where are they now? Uh, no. Uh, where is it? Is it these guys? Was it this guy? I can't remember now. Uh, planning. Hey, planning is always helping. Coldstream. Okay. Coldstream uh, Brigade. Okay, group. Uh, he's the headquarters with a, brig with a brigade. He's going in to help this infantry brigade over here. And his other brigade is going up here. 
just to clear up this hole over here on the side here. Yeah. We have this problem here. Yeah. And I might join him again. But we'll see how that thing develops. So let these guys just go. This other brigade yeah, is coming tomorrow morning. 6 o'clock. So when he comes, I'll send him where I need him. He'll be like a firefighter. In the meantime, these guys must just go. <coughs> I don't think they'll reach the, air the airport. I'm sending them on the quickest path. To help out the parabats. They'll drive through here, around here. And uh, we, we, we have this objective now. We have that one and we have this one. We're just fighting over this one. That's the only thing. We, we have this one. We have that one. We still have that one. We have almost all the objectives. Yeah, all of them. Oh, uh, no. There's nothing we missed. There's only, there's only the airfield. And then this, this is coming. Okay, that. Uh, I don't know why that, but it's, yeah, well, it's gone. That was, no, that ended. That ended. So we have everything except the airfield. The, uh, the airfield. And Dylan North. And, uh, Arnhem North. Okay, that's just up here. So we're almost, we're almost at the post. My only problem. As long as we can hold these objectives here and get the Welsh being quiet, it's one assault and they need to sit on that objective. It's as simple as that. Okay, he's still, he's still gonna go. Let him go. I'm just gonna leave him and let him go. They're still gonna day. Yeah, day in a bit. He'll still go. Yeah, the paratroopers on their own are not going to get this. Just don't have enough forces. I'm right on top of the X, but he's got 10 to 1 superiority here. That's why I'm bringing that, that uh, infantry brigade up here. To see if I can help them. And the other one I might send up there as well. It all depends. You understand? It all depends on, uh, on what, where I need him here. To fill out gaps here or whatever. I'm still trying to salt there but um there's help coming bro help is coming all right i'm gonna pause the game until there's further developments okay so these guys have just come the last reinforcements can you believe it <laughs> day five okay so where is it now these guys yeah the green howard's infantry battalion he falls under this uh, the 69th, the 69th uh, Infantry Battalion. I've sent him also up to help over there. You know that the 69th is going all the way up to help there. He's taking, he's taking two battalions with him. He's taking the East Yorks and the Green Howards with him. And they're all going up that side. Uh, yeah. Where's the Green Howards? Well, he's part of this, this Infantry Brigade. But we've sent... We've sent the uh, Green Howards. The, these are the Howards. Okay, we sent the seventh, <laughs> seventh Green Howards. Eh? The sixth and the seventh. We sent the seventh there. The sixth is going with uh, uh, the 69th Infantry Brigade Headquarters all the way up to there. All right, let's fight it. Let's see. We're doing okay. We just need to get this objective over here. Uh, we've held on to that one. We've held on to this one. I'm holding on to that one, which is great. Right, uh, this one we're holding on to, and that one we're holding on to, and all of these, 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 yeah. We just need that one, and that one. There's one here that we gave up. No, we didn't give up anything. So we're holding up, we're holding everything. Now these just guys, okay, they're, gone. they're on their way. All right, brilliant. Let them go. Yeah, the MVP here is the Irish Brigade. They held a crescent. I mean, they got probably nothing left. They got just a little left. They've, they've, they've held a. They created so many bridges, and they've held, they've held the bridge here, the opening here. So we can get in there. Polish parabats. Well, hey, you know what? You're gonna get a medal for this because <laughs> you stood so long there. You just don't have enough forces. You need a ten to one. That's why I'm bringing that, uh, 
uh, 69th Infantry Brigade with the two uh, battalions up this road and maybe we can make some effort over here. But I don't know. It's day five. We've got the whole day today and then we've got up till one o'clock tomorrow morning. So I don't know what kind of effort we're going to make. Uh, yeah, so I don't know yet. We'll see. It's going to be a long road, even though they're going this way. It's going to be a long road up here. It's on the highway, fair enough, but it's going to be a... I don't know how far they'll get up there. I just don't know. And this brigade, which is part of... Um, let me just give you an idea. Uh, it's part of the, the Coldstream. Coldstream Guards. I've sent these... He's HQ with his brigade in there, but I've sent him as a left to, to, to hold the left flank over there. He, he's facing this way, and this guy too. He's done a brilliant job. I'm not moving him. He's facing that way. Just make sure he's got most of his troops in front. All right, let's fight. Yeah, he's coming between my lines. So what? What does what, 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 what he do? Uh, sing a song. <laughs> He's gonna float in and out here. Yeah. We're gonna have to fight along the way. It's the only way to do it. Up the highway. Least least amount. As long as we got the objective hexes and they're in our favor, we don't worry. Okay. We might uh, damage our supplies, fair enough, but hey, there's nothing we can do about it. Uh, yeah. Uh, they'll have to just fuss bait. That's why I sent all these guys on this road to attack along the way to clear these guys out. Got a lot of Horrocks down here with his tank, his little re uh, armored car protecting him there. Just put it there on the side. Now we need this objective, man. We need this objective. This one. This is the objective we need. Where's his HQ yeah? Let me just look. He says you look out. That's the HQ. Right. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay. That's nice. When you go out, you go out like this, then you just see the HQs. Like the big top HQs. You click on them. See what they're doing. And we've lost this objective, but hey, you know, shit happens. Let's see if we can Let's see if we can drive him a little bit off there. I don't know what's on this side. There's no reports over here. So we'll see how that's going. Okay, I'm going to pause this video until there's further developments. Okay, so yes, the situation. It's almost the end. It's one o'clock. We managed, I managed to get this, this objective. You know that brigade I was sending, that infantry brigade I was sending up top here to come. I cancelled these move. Okay, I think that was... This is the airfield here. I think that was an airfield too far. <laughs> so the Polish are holding out there, but they just don't have enough forces, obviously. And luckily I switched this guy to face that way and I've stopped this guy on the road here with one of the Coldstream uh, battalions. And this guy facing that way, stopping coming down the road. And I managed, I did play, I did set an assault in here. Or this infantry uh, brigade, but I sort of helped. Coles, these guys coming in the Cold Street sort of helped them a lot. Um, yeah, I think we'll be able to have all these objectives, but I think this this will probably be a marginal victory. I think you need to go all the way back. Well, we don't know. <laughs> My middle name's Marginal. <laughs> See if I can get a decisive victory. Yeah, I doubt it. This is the only objective we just, just couldn't get hold of. It was just an airfield too far. <laughs> Excuse the pun. <laughs> a bit too far. <coughs> yeah. All right. So it's at the end now. Let's just see. Uh, yeah. Tough. Um, good scenario. Good scenario. Luckily, I delayed him a long, a, enough over here and over here for the forces coming through there. But, uh, so he was never able to get in here. And this lot, jeez, uh, Irish Brigade, they've got to be the MVPs, most valuable player here. They were the ones that, decisive victory, great. I thought I'd got that. Hot yes, uh, congratulations, Commander, you have a decisive victory. 
I was thrilled to hear the grand news of your smashing victory on to the final victory. And by the way, my recommendation for your well-deserved promotion and knighthood is on its way to the palace. Uh, Sir Bernard L. Montgomery. <laughs> All right, so he lost a lot more than us in terms of personnel. We lost more armored fighting vehicles and he lost a little bit more guns. He got 16 points. We ended up with 86. Okay, good. A great, great uh, uh, scenario. Uh, I think that this part, this part to delay him to get up here and to get here and get here, this delayed, the way the scenario was set up, the, the troops were brilliantly placed. So I kind of just left them there and put them on on uh, uh, defend in, in, sit, in situation. Uh, yeah, and then, yeah, these guys never, ever, ever moved. Oh, I just left them there, and they just stayed there. Uh, yeah, and this was the bugger. You know, I thought, this, this, now and then, and then this. But this was the real bugger. No, nothing was happening here. So, as I said earlier, when I sent that, that infantry brigade with two battalions, I sent them down this road, I thought maybe he could come down here and help out this Polish parachute uh, brigade. But it didn't work. I mean, it was just too far, and he just didn't have enough to hold that. So let's just look at the objectives. Uh, yeah, so we, we we got all these objectives, all the end points for these objectives. Destroy the enemy, completely destroyed. The only thing was that airfield and this. But no, this, oh yeah, okay, this. We didn't, we didn't end up holding this. We didn't, but this was for day three. Okay, so this ended at day three. So we got sort of like half the points. But that ended on day three at one o'clock. Yeah, love this game. Such an awesome fight. Uh, Irish brig uh, Brigade just holding the line here and then just enabling me to expand the bridgehead over here was what helped. And then this assault by the Welsh onto this objective. That helped a bit. And yeah, just getting them across the things was really great. I thoroughly enjoyed it. And I like this new set. I like this new setup with the, what's it now? Uh, options. This uh, auto scale icons. I think I'm going to keep it like this because it's nice. You can see the HQs from top. Just thing is when you go in, like, for example, if I'm there, I don't see these troops over here. So sometimes you can like be playing sort of like higher and then you think, ah, oh, and then you make moves. Or whatever and you don't see these oaks over here but it's nice to because it highlights obviously when you go in the, the the icons are all the same size but it highlights the smaller for example like the smaller units like there's a bigger icon than that so it's a bigger unit yeah that's how it does it all right yeah yeah i love this game all right go get it it's free to get three free scenarios and buy the volumes they're worth it go get them on steam every penny such an awesome game all right sean from combat simulations please subscribe to my channel it's free and also leave comments and suggestions and watch my videos it helps me a lot and like them too that also helps me i promise you it does all right i'm gonna fight this as the access in the next video so until our next Command Ops uh, 2 video, keeping the island afloat as the access, good day on you.